Hey, uh, good morning, everybody. Um, what's today? Uh, October 7th, Wednesday. I hope you're doing well. Just a quick update today. Um, okay, so we're, you know, a month and a half or so into school. Uh, things seem like they're, they're going pretty well. I mean, our conversations are, are certainly about maintaining, um, you know, safety protocols and ensuring that here at the school we don't, um, yeah, we don't take for granted that everything is fine. And especially since in our community, um, transmission of COVID uh, is, is coming up a bit. And, and everything that we learned and, and looked at this summer said, uh, you know, if a community transmission rises, that's when schools become, um, you know, riskier places. So just a couple of reminders, and I ask you, and, and I never ever want to come across as, uh, as um, foisting my, my sort of opinion or something on anyone, but, uh, but please, especially over this um, Thanksgiving weekend and then into limit interaction a bit. Um, our kids have been so amazing, but uh, you know, in conversation with some of them, I do worry a little bit about the amount of interaction that they have outside of here and um, not, not necessarily using uh, AHS guidelines. And, and, and while I uh, certainly understand that because um, you know, I see the joy they have in being with each other, please just chat as a family and, and see, uh, continue to reinforce both here and at school, distance, masks, um, even outside when people are together. So thanks, I mean, our whole goal here is to keep in school learning going and, and, uh, and to keep people in our community really safe um, and not being quarantined. This is one of the things that we found is both kids and families and staff here who have been quarantined, that, that is a real disruption and, and uh, that's something I'm, I'm fearful for for people, so. Uh, Alberta Health Services and Alberta's um, Occupational Health and Safety both did tours of our school um, when they, uh, they were impressed with how our students and our staff um, have kept, kept to protocols, kept to uh, all recommendations, and actually both wrote reports and in both reports said they had nothing um, for us to do differently than what we're doing. And so, time. hey, I want to give a shout out to our kids and our staff. Um, this is one of the most amazing things I've seen in my nearly quarter century career is, uh, is the work that um, our, our students and staff have done, um, the positive, uh, positive attitude that <clears throat> they have expressed this, uh, this fall, but also this idea that nothing's the same and, and uh, making it work. So I wanna, I wanna just say thanks. And then to you, our parents, as always, hang in there. This is an interesting time in all of our lives. And, uh, um, you know, I, I know uh, from friends and, and from family that, you know, it seems like everybody's under some stress right now, whether it's health stress or, uh, you know, some type of family stress, financial stress. I just want to remind you we're all in this together and that uh, as a school, we are doing our very best to take care of uh, uh, learning and the futures of our, of our kids. And, um, and we're being positive about all this and growth minded and we'll continue to do so. I hope you're all well uh, from our family here at the school and, and my family. Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, I hope you have a small, uh, intimate gathering and, and take care of each other. Okay, bye for now.